Let us backtrack a second here before we continue forward. Lord Warden's Harness. We need to just get a little bit more of gear department. Let's pop him here. Archer, oh Archer, where are you? There we go. Boost her all the way up. Knight. And the dragon. Boost it up to a four. Yep, those guys are coming over the water. That's what they're planning anyways. I believe in you, Archer. I'm just gonna get the priest down. Seems the best. And get boost her up. Fifty twos, fifty ones, fifty threes. Ooh, here we go. Shell beast. on the dragon next. Alright, shell beast. A giant carpus protects this monstrositous blob of disgusted flesh. Digested flesh? One suspects it has no bonuses of its own. No bones of its own, not bonuses. Oh, silly me. Get that armor piece. That'll be good. Plus a little more experience before we move onward. Just to ensure that we will be victorious. <laughs> now we're just coming all out of the south. River Ghoul. River Ghoul's attack, but apparently they do. Oh, let's get the dragon here. There we go. So far, doing okay. No issues. North's getting hit a little bit hard. Come on, Archer. I believe in you. She's doing so awesome. Little flame. And we'll lightning the rest. Excellent. Poison to all attacks. Piercing shot. Deal more damage. That's always nice. Freeze an ice ball. Here we go. Ice shard. 
and devour. Lord Warden's Harness It's dimly identified as owner of this excellent plate harness as for Lord Warden, the Ash official assigned to oversee the pit. How he came to be lost inside his own prison is unknown, but bloodstains on the shoulder straps indicate that the story did not end well. Yeah. 45. Hmm. Priest me. Oh, can't, priest can't wear it. That's right. She's the only one who can wear it. Alright, 45. I would love to put my priest in it, but nope. Alright. Now that we're prepared, battle away. The face of madness. Crazy Cat rushes to stop, stop Zama from igniting the crystal and destroying the pit forever. Lar, lar, la, la, la. Stop, Crazy Cat. You see now what we fight, a wretched wizard trapped in a prison. Even now his dark intelligence strives against us, reaching out its tenderlings to the tools it has left. He knows he will soon be locked away forever. I'm not going to let you do it. I had hoped it would not come to this. But if you choose your own death, the blood, the new blood seal will be that much stronger for it. I cannot let you kill all these people. Crazy Cat, I have killed millions. But just a few thousands I can stop this. Him. These lives are but another small drop among the ocean already upon my hands. I won't have it on mine! Ooh, don't get him mad. Hmm, four ways. Here if we put him here. Just gonna consolidate. Difficult to say. Move boost her all the way up. Need that range. A knight. Seems like a good choice here. And a healer. Okay, well, that tells me where I need to put the healer. One shot. Zamar. Zamar's eyes glow with result determination. Resolute. Uh oh, let's slow it down. I'm gonna need to personally take care of these guys. Shadows. PSI. More slugs. So this one's gonna be the dangerous one. I'm gonna take care of the other two. Not so much. Bump it up to two. Throw out a dragon fire here. There we go. Oh damn. Knight almost got one shot. Be careful about upgrading anybody who's away from my. Uh, don't hit the knight. Okay, hit here. Need to pop out a heal again. And one more. Now 
bodies in the bottom corner. Oh, I don't like the fact that he's hitting them. Yeah, I'll never heal. And I'm going to need to... Frustrating thing is, the level is going to continue to increase. Until it's a is taken care of. So my side is going to be hit quite hard. Now we're hitting him. Maybe there's just a little bit. Let's pop out a heal. Yeah, drag it up again. Still a long way to go for him. We need to. You know, all these shadow worms. Afford to lose for night. This is going to be a very long and dangerous battle. The enemy keeps raising the levels. And he's just a scratch. There's only really one spot I can get where I can hit him two spots. Boost the priest up. And the dragon. There we go. And I'm out of PSI crap. Oh, that was close. Need to heal up. because I don't want them hitting my knight because the knight is taking so much damage and I don't have a healer for him. Do some damage to him myself. Now that we actually have the uh, PSI. Shadow worms incoming. Let's slow down there. Get rid of all this side here. Throw out a heal. Such a little heal, so much. Because I didn't upgrade it all. Can't 
kill my dead guy but night taking damage so that really uh clean out that side a little bit good enough let's hit some mars some more until we have about 300 psi i'm gonna keep a good stockpile Again. Clean up this monstrosity over here. Now uh, PSI will build up again. Whoa. So that's good. Lower it down to 50. Everybody's still okay. Similar's about halfway. We got shadow worms coming out again here soon. So far doing okay. Let's focus the Mar down until we get 300. Because now we're on the PSI grab. Jump over here. Oh, I have shadow worms here soon. and a frenzy boy hitting my uh, my knight all right now I need to clean up this side again Side building area again. I can just hit him. Hopefully, try to finish him off here. Okay, not allowed to do anything until I have 400 psi. How much health does he have? <laughs> Probably 190,000. Not too bad. PSI is back. And they're gonna do some damage to him, so that's good. How much damage they do? About 20,000. Shadow worms are getting harder to take, take out. But we follow this. Should be okay. It's gonna heal out. And a fireball. side. Okay, now focus everything we have on him again. All PSI. Try to rush this guy down. Oop, let's do a frenzy. Pop into range. 
and do a crystal. Much damage they possibly can. Okay, hold off now. So we need to save up for the shadow worms coming out. Fifty-five thousand. Slow it down to a one speed. Uh, we are so close. The enemy is starting to get pretty difficult to handle. Alright, let's get out a fire blast. What is he up to? 20,000. This is almost over. Yeah, pop out a heal. And a frenzy. Pick it up to a 2 speed. Finish him off. Hoo -hoo. Now that was a battle. Chance at stun to lunge. And dragon fire. Assassin's Folly. At first glance, this appears to be no more than an ornate nobleman's shirt. Closer inspections reveal row upon row of light metal and plates sewn to the inside of the garment. A gash at the small of the back indicates that this is ingenious design, foiled at least one assassin. 28 though. It's better than what he had. Well fought, crazy cat. But you're too late. The signal has gone out. And now... The pit collapses, and we all give our lives to trap the Taj forever. You can't, you can't kill all these people. No, no. Ooh, I think she's angry. Released by Crazy Cat's blood, as Taj Tanach arises, the God King walks again. Warlord Triumph, 7 for 48, with 1,702,000 health. I think we should try it first at normal. Marcus, what just happened? We are in the halfway world. The people? They are here. What? All of them? Everyone in the pit. I pulled them in. They are safe. But that's thousands of people. How can... Crazy Cat, you've been hurt. You're bleeding. No, the blood. The new seal is not completed. You can't let that blood... Uh-oh. Zamar, I will not lie idly by and watch the monster I've fought so long escape. You will murder... You murderer, you think we will? This is not the time. Either we kill him or all is lost. After that, you may take your vengeance. Okay. Four ways. Interesting. We should get the knight. Hmm. I think if we it's too far that might be best and 
gonna boost everybody up around. Got multiple shields. It's no use. His magic's protecting him. What can we possibly do? Lady, we are here with you. Until now, you have been lending your powers to others. But now, we lend ours to you. For the first time, Crazy Cat herself can be boosted. Ooh. How delightful. Boost up this and move it to a four. We need to get the healer up. Oh, hello. Boost into a four. A bit risky. An option there. Okay, he's going after her. I don't know if it's... Let's go to a two. One is... It's slow. Magic is protecting him. Powerful magic can break this. Okay, so I do need to boost her up first before I need to continue. Lady, let us help you. Lady, our prayers are with you. The power of all of us, united in one. Ooh, that's like some Captain Planet shit right there. Oh, he hopped away. Oh, this is a Mars like uh, healing me up and whatnot. My troops, so that's nice. So nice of him. Good. Let's get a flame blast out. And bump her up. have one more magical shield. 350 PSI. I will say I like having Zamar on my side. It makes it a lot uh, more interesting. Now we can boost everybody else up. Knight. But Knight first because he's right in my way. The only line of protection. So now we can do damage to him again in his multiple shield walls. up here. You know, watch out for those uh, shadow guys. They're only level 27, so I think we'll be okay. Let's do a flame blast. Getting too close. <laughs> oh, right out of her range. Bump her up. There we go. 
soon as he moves back to the middle, he's done for. It's just a matter of when. Upgraded Zeal, which gives everybody else a damage increase. So that's good. Now we have a dragon, fireball. Uh, now he's in the middle and he's taking damage, so that's good. We'll get that shield off him. Clean up this middle. Stop popping magic of my own on him. Yeah, he's turned into an old man. Shall I speak to a dog in its own tongue? The rebel that begged me to be their god now shakes with fists at heaven, poisoning the air with empty threats. In what world can you face me? I am as Tash Tanakh. You are one great being spread over many, but many are united in me. I am the conduct. We all strike you down as one fool. This is my domain. You may be able to come halfway with feeble steps, but only I can walk the paths of the spirit. What's happening? He has gone all the way into the other side. We cannot reach him from this halfway world. There is a way. Crazy Cat, you are like me. You can call others into this halfway world. But with all these people here lending us their power, I can feel it. With all our combined power, I can enter the other world completely. And there I will kill the wretched wizard. You cannot do this alone, brother. Take me with you. No, the fault is mine. I will pay the price alone. Rabble the fool as you think a dog can. Crazy Cat, now is the time. Concentrate. Go, Zamar. Finish this. Well, at least, uh, he made up for it in the end. Get that evade up. I strike through. To, uh, to hit multiple foes. Yeah, that's nice. <laughs> Who would have thunk it? Crazy cat, the pit is collapsing. How long can we stay safe in this halfway world? Not long, and if a boulder squishes me, we're all dead. Wait, if I send Zema to the other world, maybe I can send all of us. What? All the way over to the other side? Thanks, but I'd rather get squished and collapse. No, it can work either direction. It can send us back out, out of a pit. We're still in our world. Well, you better hurry up and... Boom. Do it, because things are... Oh. Way to go, crazy cat. When? Could you take a look at this? It really hurts. Wow. That's why... That's... That's a nasty wound. The bone looks broken, too. That should do for now. 
We'll have to sling and splint it in a minute, but first, what are we going to do with all these people? There's thousands of them. We've got a whole army to feed. The local nomads aren't going to trade for scrap. You mortals. I command you to take these disgusting mortal babbles. They stink of your kind. They have no place among the gods. Thank you. What? You must understand me, mortal. That was a command. Remove these offensive items at once. Of course, mighty one. So what will you do now? I've had enough of your mortal doings for quite some time and shall return to my own kind. I must find a mate to teach my children. These crippled wings cannot pass on the glories of flight. Farewell, great one. May you always feel the fire's warmth. And to you. I misjudged you, child of fire. Did she just... Well, we won't be starving, that's for sure. We discuss for days. Nomad caravans gladly trade food for our gold. The various leaders among the refuse I heard, but everyone is too glad to be alive to argue. It is still strange to breathe fresh air. Finally, all are in agreement. Are you returning with us, Elder? I do not know. It is a bittersweet joy to see this day. I, I never intended to live this long. Perhaps your redemption is found not in a single moment, but in an entire lifetime. You are wise beyond your years, Crazy Cat. There is still much suffering and chaos in the world, and as much, as, and as such, ample opportunity for the Sonali. But what you, Crazy Cat, can you return to the library? My old life in the library is a welcome refuge from these adventures, and while it is strange to live without my powers, I am glad to feel like myself once again. Yes, I had always wondered where those strange abilities had come from. I believe when Estar Tanash tried to corrupt you, he poured a little of his own spirit into you. In refusing corruption, you used his power against him. Now he is dead, and his magic dies with him. It is strange, but I am not sad to see it go. At this point, simple life in an unimaginable luxury. May we all see such luxuries. But I will keep you too long. But I keep you too long. You have much journeying to do. Farewell, Crazy Cat, until such time as we meet again. May it not be too often, Elder. Rever Reverend Elder, I owe you so much. If you would but accept the tokens of my gratitude when your people need that treasure far more than I. Then accept my invitation. Come, see us when the halls of fire burn once again. Perhaps the wisdom of your Sinnet, Celadent, will please the cosmic flame. I would be honored, daughter of fire. I must take my leave now. The way of Celadent calls me to the suffering. But we shall meet again. Farewell, Reverend Elder. May you always feel the flame's warmth. Crazy Cat. When? Are you sure you will be fine without us? I fear for your safety without the might of a quad amongst your ranks. It is a long way to ash. Bandits, wolves, or perhaps a slight breeze could demolish you. <laughs> and what of you? You no longer have any powers either. I am Quad Princess, born with blade in hand. I have practiced the arts of war my entire life, and through the forest, frost was useful. I am glad to see it gone from my heart. We shall bring glory to a, fl to a flame, as we always have, with sword and bow and strength of arm. And I, the rest of my people, shall return to our homes. We will find what is left of our world and build a greater one on top of it. It is good to see that you haven't changed a bit, friend. May you find luck in your endeavors. And you as well, friend of the flame. And may we meet again. Farewell. 
Yo. So, what are your plans, Salk? Will you return to Will you return to Ashworth with us? Are you kidding me? A life of wealth and luxury? Not while there's still killing to be done. I've been talking to some of the nomadic refugees, and they tell me there's this monster in the far north called the Eye of a Rock. He's got like seven heads, each one with seven eyes. I've never decapitated something with seven heads. Plus, from there I can head a little east and beat the snout out of some more of those blood cultist punks. I only need three more of the skull soaked cloaks to finish my magnificent turban of violence. I'm glad to see you have a plan, but look at me talking one of those acts of random violence to be committed. Keep in touch. <laughs> I think I'm going to miss him. Hey. Hey, I thought you were leaving with the nomads. No, I, I decided not to. I'm just... There's a whole world out there, and maybe some other geek has survived. If so, they're going to need all the help they can get. Or maybe I'll just, you know, wander around it a little bit. I think Salk is looking for adventure. Really? He, uh, he makes a tolerable comrade in arm. And he does owe me money. <laughs> he went that way. Thanks, Crazy Cat. Anytime. My lady? Marcus, the Ash refugees are ready to leave when you are. What about you, Marcus? You want to go back to the capital? These are my people. Besides, my debt still binds me, lady. I will accompany you until I may repay it. Your debt is paid, my friend. I release you from your word. Then, may I accompany you as a friend? There are many dangers on the road. I will... All of us will be glad to have you. And I will be glad to be with them. You know... It will seem strangely boring to travel without something trying to kill us every other step. Well, I bet that Tipsy Tiger song would help pass for time. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, but I'm afraid I'll be far too busy no longer being indebted to you, and therefore never having to listen to such insane suggestions again. Really? Because I have a whole list of insane suggestions. Seeing as we won't be enjoying the Tipsy Tiger song, I might as well start going through them to entertain myself. 1. Stop wearing that purple skirt thingy. I was doing the purple skirt thing before you, and it looks better on me. <laughs> hey. 2. How small sugar gliders in your si sideburns because, hey, who doesn't like sugar gliders? They could attack people who irritate you. 3. Name the sugar gliders Righty and lefty, but keep them on opposite sideburns to confuse your enemies. <laughs> genius! It's just genius! You have spent way too much time. A lot. <laughs> too. You spent way too long around Sulk. By the way, I've got a couple hundred of these, so it's going to be a very long walk to Ash. <laughs> oh, I'm a tipsy tiger. Okay, now one foot and in flat, so. <laughs> oh, well, thank you for everybody that has watched through this playthrough. And I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did to do it. Feel free to leave comments below and subscribe. As always, see you next time.